Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you guys your daily journal message for Tuesday, November 28th, 2023. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in your own private reading, all the information as well as the link, the, link, the Amazon link, is down below where my book is. Let's get started here. Before we begin, uh, first things first, November 28th is my parents' anniversary. They're probably up there. Both of them dance in the Johnny Mathis right now. I can envision that. Uh, but definitely they both liked uh, Johnny Mathis. So, uh, yes. <laughs> uh, we are also going live tonight, uh, Tuesday night around 6, 6.30, more closer to 6.30, you know. Uh, but to answer any of your love questions, finances, the only ones I do not answer are in regards to either law or health. I'm not legally allowed to answer those types of questions because I am not one of them. Uh, but yeah, uh, so let's get started here. Hope to see you tonight around 630 during the live. Just pop on in. You can say hi, even if you don't have a question. So let's get started here for today's energy. What people need to know for today, Tuesday, November 28th, 2023. I literally hear someone saying, I can accept them back, but if they walk away from me and burn me again like this, I'm not going to ever deal with them again. Basically, what that statement is, you know what you want. You know what you're willing to tolerate as well. This is a 15-card spread, by the way, more the merrier. You miss them. You miss the fun that you had. They were a little stubborn, okay? You kind of turned away from their energy and moved away from them, but you kind of, somebody out there, you're stalking. I almost feel like it's a twin, too. So, uh, But regardless, I feel that they, they still need a little bit more work on their own selves here, okay? They're, they, they are feeling the... Uh, the energy of nobody loves me, you know, kind of thing. But yeah, they're pouting. I, I literally feel like they're pouting, uh, you know, like emperor dude wise, okay, your partner here, because they brought it on themselves, I most feel, okay. Uh, but yeah, but you kind of kind of got over it kind of thing. But somebody out there, a different group of people are definitely stalking to see what they're up to. Uh, and you find no reason not to. I, I get it. I totally get it. There is this urge to want to communicate to them here, but there's this indecisiveness, uh, confusion, what if I do that, you know, kind of thing. I kind of like my the way that my life is rolling. I'm more balanced here, and Spirit's kind of saying, don't communicate to them, okay? Don't make that option. Let them come to you. You got the King of Cups, of course. They do love you here, and right underneath it is the Fool. So they will be the one that returns to you. I do feel that. So let's do the above and below here. And I got some clarifiers here. Sun card, king of swords could be dealing with air sign. You got Aries, you got, uh, sorry, and the four of cups. So yes, they are pounding. Yes, they are stubborn. Yes, they refuse to offer their love, okay? And yes, you do miss them. They miss you here, but you've decided to move forward, move away from that because you're done fighting over this. Now I did clarify the... Uh, you know, the uh, Queen of Wands here with the uh, Knight of Cups, the Eight of Cups, and the uh, Devil here. So it's been a long time, but I'm willing to accept them back here. But, you know, uh, if they move away from me, if they ghost me again, I'm not going to have anything to do with them. Okay. And so you basically know what you want. Ten of Wands, the Chariot, and the Six of Swords. So, say la vie. You 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 left their energy here. They left you kind of ghosting energy, but there's going to be movement again. I feel it's them. Now, there is this temptation of you reaching out to them, but let spirits like basically saying, let them come to you here uh, with the Page of Swords, the King of Cups, and the Fool card. The Three of Cups, the Eight of Swords, the Page of Pentacles. So they do feel a little bit bad here, uh, guilty here. Some could be dealing with the third party as well. Uh, but I'm really feeling that they still, all in all, they still need to put in that work here, but they will be returning with that page of pentacles, which is actually an apology card. Just don't expect a 10 page, you know, 15 page essay. 
So the outcome cards are the Two of Swords, the Seven of Cups, the Moon, the Six of Cups, the Empress, and the Hierophant. Well, the Hierophant's hand is basically looking, you know, pointing over at your energy as the Empress. Don't go to them kind of thing in regards to somebody that you already know, that you have a connection with here. There's that temptation, but it's kind of like, nah, I don't know, but I'm up in my head. I'm confused. What should I do? You know, should I make, should I be the one that makes nice, nice and checks in on them and be nice? Or, no, let, I feel that spirit's kind of telling you, just let them come to you here. So that is what I have. Uh, thank you all for watching. I do appreciate it. As always, don't forget to smash that like button, uh, subscribe, as well as comment down below. And hope to see you tonight around 6.30 p.m. for um, live and answering questions. Thanks, guys. Have a good one, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.